How many times have you heard a teacher say, I need problems to make good tests? And not just any kind of problem, but one that has words, pictures, something that will really get them ready for STAR, get used to reading and thinking. Well, Problem Addict does that for you. Would you please open up Chrome and go to www.problem-attic.com. And we're gonna sign up now. Okay, when you're there, click sign up now. And I'm going to use the Google account that we've been using all day today. The same one that opened up my YouTube. And my password I'm going to use the same password for me. You can change it if you want, but I don't want to have the problem of forgetting. Okay? And there are your terms of service if you want to go in and read. I've already done that. And I'm in. So, thanks for signing up is what it says. Da -da 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 -da. I'm not going to read to you. Um, how do you use it? So... We, you can read about a few things there if you like. I want to create my first document, so I'm going to do that. I'm going to title it um, First Six Weeks um, Test. Okay. Continue. And it's good to go ahead and have a system on how to name your uh, test because if you make a lot of them and you call it test A, test B, but you don't remember what six weeks it's from, when you get to the end of the year and you go back to look, you're like, uh, when did I use this again? <laughs> Even though it has dates and everything, it's really good to go ahead and have a system down as to how you're going to name your, um, your test or quizzes for that matter. So I always put a first six weeks or a fifth six weeks or you know, when I used it. And from here you choose where you want to, where you want to find and, you know, find problems. And I hear that New York region exams are really good ones to look at, although there are so many to pull from. And you have Algebra 1, Geometry, Algebra 2, Trigonometry, Multi-Step Problems. Um, so, in Algebra 1, there are the topics you can pick from so let's choose uh, come on with it Chelsea stop taking so long <laughs> I'm trying to find a good one I didn't think this far okay slope of line and here are the questions and you can just keep going and keep going Pictures already done, already done, word problems already done. And again, this is not the only place you can look. So I'm going to go back here and let's see. How do you go and find another place to look other than New York Regents? So let's go back. Um, let's look under state assessments. Oh. Okay, so we're looking at slope. I wonder, will you find it before me? And you're on, on the other end saying, um, click, there it is, you missed it, you passed it. Um, inter interpret slope and y intercept, okay. Ooh, look at this. Hmm. Okay, so I like this one, I'm gonna hit add. I like this one. I'm going to add that one. Mmm, I like that one. I'm going to pause it because my child is coming in. Give me just a moment. Sorry about that. They're three and two. Okay, back to it. So, um, the different representations here, I mean, it's amazing. You get the word problems, you get the graphs, and from, and here's the table here. Let me add that one. And now I go to the next step. I can arrange how I pick these problems. And so, multi-step, I'm good with that. 
and then formatting. You can choose if you want one column, um, one column and answer spaces, or two columns. So I'm going to choose one column and you can preview it. And it comes out as a PDF. There you go. 